Okay, uh, welcome my fellow journeymen, um, on Hello, our journeyman. epic quest to vanquish the evil that has plagued this land so. My name is, uh, what is my name? Resurrection. I'm being played by, uh, Walter 80. And, uh, in case you are wondering why it is that I am talking as such, it is because for this episode of replay, which is again kind of breaking the wall that we've established, uh, we will be role-playing our characters as best we can, which means we're going to try to talk like they do, as for as long as we can. Uh, I am joined by fellow comrades upon this epic adventure, uh, Lapa, also known as Tim Smith. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay, this is good. Um, also with me uh, is the legendary Lonin, who is played by Alphonsus Degra. Delgra. Delgra. Uh, also the uh, cunning and sexy Laser Dyke, played by <laughs> Journey Woman. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, this is Cutting gonna be, indeed. This is gonna be tragic. <laughs> Played by John Gramatsky. Dr Your Gramatsky. death is gonna be tragic. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, last but not last but not least, the sturdy and heroic people with axe. Played by Ben Textor. People with axe. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Pull it together, Walter. We're doing good. I'm, I'm, uh, this is gonna work. I apologize for that. Okay. Welcome to the sixth episode of the Diablo 2 Ultra Replay, everybody. If I can keep myself together here, we'll be, we'll be a okay. Okay. Oh, man. I'm sorry. I apologize. Yeah. I apologize in advance for this episode. What episode? I don't know what you're talking about. Yes. Oh, uh, what I do mean is that our endeavor in which we are about to embark upon is our search for the la the maggoty layer, which is uh, hidden well underneath the far oasis. Uh, of course, of course. It seems like a lengthy trip. It, uh, it shall be a voyage of great magnificence. Quite. <laughs> it's getting dark here. Verily. Oh, wow, I'm, I'm the only one that is still in town. Everybody has left without me, it, it oh. seems. Nah. <laughs> Adventure waits for no man or woman. <laughs> well, I shall take the, uh, the waypoint to the hills that are dry. So I guess I'll be the one that is leaving the rest of you behind. Waypoint? What, what now? Sure. I'm just venturing through our way here. Casting this boulders of fire. I don't know any enemy that can't stand that. Verily, I am confused. I am caveman. How come? <laughs> oh my god. Oh wait, no I'm not. <laughs> I'm a barbarian. How do barbarian stuff? I I think it's a lot of growls and grunts and screams. I mean, uh, uh how is it that you the barbarians in these realms are actually quite eloquent. <laughs> Believe it or don't. No. <laughs> Oh fuck! No. <laughs> this is going so well. Help, Walter! Open this charm, please. I have received. I've received some grievously mortal wounds. <laughs> Only barely did I survive such encounter. Acromancer uh, would really talk. You probably sound a little more grizzled than that. Part. Oh, 
Apparently, we are getting our asses kicked. Demons hurt people. <laughs> oh no! Holy hell! <laughs> oh. oh no! They're raping me. What happened? Oh. <laughs> our comrade has fallen in battle. Oh, oh. No. <laughs> Oh god, not we lost another one. <laughs> oh man. Uh, oh, now portal to your veins. <laughs> and steal your gold. Wait, we must. That's how assassins do. I should say, my fellows, that we must regroup. Yeah, we definitely. Must yeah, find sure, people body. <laughs> Run away! <laughs> Yo, carrying bird, have my ass taste. Do I seriously lose all my weapons? Oh no! No! <laughs> <laughs> I I doth hear a damsel in distress. <laughs> Damn right I'm distressed. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea of animals. I saw it. It's such a good bow. Thine thine equipment is actually retrievable. Should you <laughs> chance <up? laughs> should you chance upon your corpse? Oh. Good evening. Oh, huh, what oh type yeah. of is this? Oh, happy that day! <laughs> Everything is here. I am no bard. <laughs> what opiate doth thou be ingesting, Blapa? That is causing you. <laughs> that is causing you to talk as such. Estrogen. <laughs> okay, uh, I I verily request thee upon the dry hills, where comrade Pupa with axe and I are getting destroyed. Get destroyed? We are getting destroyed. Where are you guys? We are in the dry hills where we are supposed to be. Uh, so far, I only Kill, see dry. Lapa and Laser Knight with me. We, used, we, we, we went via Waypoint. They probably didn't say via back then. Alright, well, I'm gonna go back into town and rescue all you. I am dying again. Holy hell. Thou shalt frequently die without my <laughs> guiding. Aw, <laughs> uh, we even need to team up. Oh, well, we got more company. Ah. Uh, uh, Funny this boulder was like way, way bigger. This is so not going well. <laughs> Verily. Yes, yeah. I shall attest to. This whole staying in character thing is really. Uh, I, th <laughs> I think I, I think someone wants this. It's a ten thousand dollar staff. What? I think that's mine. I mean, car barbarian. Mine. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> I'm getting destroyed. Oh, oh Christ. Okay, perhaps this whole character thing is not gonna work, cause, <laughs> cause we are getting killed. Oh my god, what are these? Yeah. <laughs> what kind of steroids What's are these? a long staff? We were doing so well last time. These things are actually so. <laughs> Does any sorcerers want this? There is no source. Sword. There is no source, sword, so I can sell this. It's all you, bro. Oh man, do I have to keep talking like a lady, or can I talk? Uh, I, I don't know. That was, that was hard. It's really up to you at this point. It was very, it was very hard. Do you want to talk like a lady? I'm just saying. I'd rather not. No. <laughs> Thine fools be a pansy. <laughs> no. I'm just trying to channel every single type of life experience I've like been through. Yeah, I'm. Yeah, I'm. I've never really done that before. I just wanted to make sure everyone knew. <laughs> it was kind of fun. <laughs> it was fun, but we are way. That is above our level. Yeah, <laughs> not yet. I'm. I'm like a level one larper, I guess. So. <laughs> Online LARPer. I was I was pulling everything I had, but I just couldn't keep up. <laughs> it's, you know, it's pretty overwhelming. Like when you first uh, like go into it, it's, it's 
Oh, so you can't. Oh. Have, you been, have you done it before, uh, Alfonso? Yeah, I, I've blocked a few times before. Um, really? Yep. Yeah. Uh, like a few times in this uh, things called uh, night realms. It's uh, it's pretty much kind of like a medieval orb. Um, they kind of like to take place around like the few states of like New York, New Jersey, and Pennsylvania. And then recently, I've got into this uh, orb similar to like a Fallout 3, Fallout Vegas, called uh, Dystopia Rising. It's actually from like the same company, just a different time period and stuff. Where do you do these at? Um, well, the Dystopia Rising, we just usually have this in like in New Jersey, I think Sparks in New Jersey. Uh, we got like a campground that um, uh, the people I just bought out so they can just like, you know, build buildings and stuff. Mm -hmm. um, for Night Realms, I think it's uh, it's spread out like from like Sparta to like, uh, I, don't, I don't know where because I'm making it, but like, it kind of like, they have like special locations like that. You know, we just pretty much fly for like an entire weekend and pretty much you want to watch out when you're sleeping because you can actually get killed in your sleep. Wow. <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah so that's why people, like, especially people in groups, they always have like, you know, watch, lookout parties to make sure it's like, holy crap, we're being under attack. Yeah, let's kill these guys before they, they kill us. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, that actually, it's actually like a Who lot are the of fun. enemies in this? Enemies were pretty much like zombies or like any other like NPCs. Like, uh, in addition to say our player character, pretty much everyone's assigned an NPC shift. So pretty much we would report to say logistics or whatever, and we would just you know like give us like all right, you're gonna be a zombie, you're gonna be like a slave or whatever. And he's just like you know, they just pretty much you know you guys, send you out there. Uh, if you guys want to join us, by the way, we are. Where are you? Oh, wow. Yeah, where are you? We're alone tonight by ourselves. I didn't even realize it. Where the hell are you guys? We're in the middle of the uh, dry hill. Oh, you guys got a portal? Take my portal. Yeah, that's interesting. I mean, it, it seems it seems like it wouldn't be too hard, though, when you really, like, look at it. You know, it's like, oh, all they're doing is talking. Like, a bunch of crazy people. Yeah. <laughs> How hard could that but, be? It, uh... Well, in like the in the DER, the Fallout 3 type world, they have like, I guess it's a bit more like you know modern and stuff. Like, there's even this guy who was like a sniper, and just randomly one day he just like starts sniping out random people. I was like, I was like, is he allowed to do this? So like, yeah, actually he can. Wow. Uh, how do how do you do that? How do you determine you got sniped? Um, pretty much they have like a rules marshal along with the sniper, and pretty much We're just. With like a reload time, whatever, and if Take you line up the portal. shot, oh. Take laser knife's portal, and you can get right to where we are. Are there, do you, you like wear a headset, and somebody's like, oh, you've been sniped, you're dead now, or what? We gotta go back to town. Uh, no, I think there, yeah, just go back to town and take laser knife's yeah. portal, and you get right to where we are. Gotcha. Um, no, yeah, it's, it's, I think you have like two rules marshals. One, like, uh, that's with the sniper, and another one to kind of coordinate, so saying like, alright, you got shot in the head, you got shot in the balls, and... <laughs> <laughs> but it's it's based off like Fallout Three style, so you don't have kind to talk of, yeah. like all crazy. Yeah, just, yeah, just like pretty it's, much just like it's three two hundred years after say the like apocalypse via um uh, nuclear option. That's pretty cool though. Uh, yeah, I mean Fallout Three is pretty much definitely my favorite game ever. There we go. Yeah, same here. All right, all right I'm here. Just wanna go kill some bitches? Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Uh, Verily. Okay. Yes. Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> no, no, it just seemed like, oh, it'd be fun. Let's all play as our character, but dear God. Like, <laughs> I was so busy it. trying yeah. to think about how I should be talking that I was just getting, <laughs> Yeah, same here. Yeah, like, chilling. same here. It's like, it's like, it's pretty much just, like, just acting pretty much. For, uh, some people, they manage, like, you know, it's a great character, or just, just for the, like, hilarity of it, of the situation. <laughs> I mean, I figured it'd probably be funny, but oh man, you were amateur. <laughs> it probably was funny for other people. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. I mean, you're that, and it makes us look like a bunch of idiots. <laughs> yeah, oh, waypoint. So we're looking for the far oasis, by the way. Are you guys over by that waypoint? That sounds maybe? far. We've already got that waypoint. Yeah. It sounds far out. Oh. I lost you guys. Yeah, so the far oasis has to be uh, theoretically somewhere. Sounds. Sounds from pretty far. Oh, judging by the name. Yeah. 
snake. Yonder oasis dwelleth quite out of reach. If this. Turban monkeys. Oh, those are. Those aren't turban. Fire! Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're just kind of spamming that magic, aren't you? Making up for the yeah. fact we don't have a sorceress. Pretty much. Yeah. I was just gonna try to this I still think transforming into bears and wolves is the coolest thing the druid does. Oh, that looks like uh, oh, an oasis that is far. You can't really transform into a bear. I just wear like bear skins and stuff over my body. Huh? Sort of like the same thing. Yeah. It looks it looks the part, but it doesn't really do anything. Is that and you're talking about in real life? That's how you dress? Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, in real life. You're like walking down the street. And uh, you're like, oh, it's time. Bloody bears. Yeah, it's time for me to transform into a bear. Mhm. Mm Just whip out my bear skin to start over like a coat. That's pretty cool. Oh, I found something. Huh? What is it? What does it say? Like bear or the far, the far away. So here we go. That's far where we're headed. We want Boom. That, yeah. South. I found something. Boom. About time. Hey, look at Usually don't do that. Yeah. <laughs> That's a rarity. Once the experience, right? We all share it. Oh, oh man, these are those beetles. Oh man. These are those beetles I was mentioning, I think, in the last episode. It, every time you hit them, they spew lightning everywhere. Man, that, that's... There's this thing, it was a, a, a black raptor nest that sounds so much more like intimidating than it was. <laughs> it was just spitting out like flies. <laughs> Ooh, level up. Whatever these bad things are. Oh, uh, there's 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 like mosquitoes too or something. Oh man. Yeah, it's like swarms of bugs that steal your stamina. Right now they're called itches. So we're fighting the itches. The itches. <laughs> sure to look out for uh, what's that disease you get in the jungle? Malaria. Oh, I suppose so. Where? From the itches. <laughs> I thought you were going for swamp crotch again. <laughs> uh, for some reason, I like saying that. I think that's the second time now I've said swamp crotch. Do you have a swamp crotch? <laughs> Not at the moment. Is that what you're mentioning? <laughs> there are a lot of dead things laying around here. Yeah, why am I. I'm using its saber. No wonder I'm doing so crappy right now. We're looking for the maggot layer, which, uh, you know, we were kind of getting blocked by each other a lot last episode. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, the maggot layer is going to be even worse. Oh, oh. Fantastic. I'm going back to town temporarily. I got to do some uh, shifting of equipment. Yeah, same here. Yeah, maggot layer is a very cramped amount of space. I mean, it was, it was in fact so made by maggots. So. Yeah, it sounds like my garbage can. <laughs> <laughs> you know you are supposed to actually throw out garbage. Oh really? Yeah, that's actually what. I just like, kind of like. You yeah, can no. Do once that, you uh, once you start to, it's like once your garbage can becomes overburdened with loot, <laughs> uh, huh. you can take it to a garbage receptacle, like a dumpster or perhaps even a garbage pickup truck. And you can. Ah, uh, those it. with those. Yeah, that's actually what they're for. You can place it into oh, those. Oh, okay. And uh, they will remove the maggot layer from your possession, so you don't have to deal with it. Uh, I thought they were just like, you know, go through neighborhoods just waking people up. I didn't know they actually. Well, they do that too. That's the uh, th their job is kind of twofold. That's why they get paid so highly. They actually they do two jobs at once. Well, we are all. Explain why my neighbors hate me. 
Is everybody in town? Split up, gang. Yeah. No, no, we're we're, we're all we're over Kingdom Come. We're split up all over the place. Oh. Explained why my neighbors hate me and they. Uh, oh, you know they, what? The they always hand me garbage bags. Oh, oh somebody <laughs> found a maggot that. layer. Tim found the maggot layer. Oh, really? Woo! Yeah. I thought he was still talking He's... about his garbage. <laughs> well, I mean, he is and he isn't. <laughs> I guess everybody head toward Bloppa. So that we can uh, hit up that mag. Not too close, though. He's got mag. I'm going to Lair, so you can't see me. Yeah, everybody kind of stand up, stand back a little bit. I can't see yeah. your square things on the map. That is a maggoty layer right there. Uh, Tim, from the position I'm standing, I can see your ass cheeks, actually. <laughs> you like it? What? <laughs> Tell me you like it. It was acceptable. Mm. I'd say yeah. on a scale of one to five, yeah. it was, it was a number. It looks like she just like has like a loincloth over her. Yeah, there's not a whole lot. It doesn't even look like she's wearing anything else. Yeah, it's kind of, it's not a whole lot covering go. her up there. She's kind of oh. flailing in the wind, as it were. Kind of like a Sonya. Yeah. Yeah, here we are in the maggot layer, and it's uh, about one person thick. Mage. Just like a garbage can. So I'm gonna <laughs> you can kind of stand back and curse everybody, and uh, I guess since people with axe is a barbarian, he can kind of tank his way through. I mean, I can I can kind of tank this because the thing is, I, what I have is I have a move that lets me drain health from enemies with my special attack, my finishing attack, so I can like drain. I can like get, I can. Get, Get, like all health and mana back on a regular basis just by hitting enemies. That's actually so curious. A, the, the curse I'm using right now uh, causes you to whoever attacks the enemy to gain health. Oh, life tap, sweet. Yeah. Uh, we are we are just peas in a pod in this place, aren't we? Yeah. We're peas in a pod. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. oh man. <laughs> Whoa, was there lag? No, it's. I think it's. We're all just stuck. There is lag. Oh, there is lag. Cause I'm not cast. No, I think we're just stuck. I don't think it's lag. I'm, I'm still. Fine. Yeah, I'm killing things. Yeah, I'm st I, I think... am experienced. Yeah, I'm lag. yeah. I don't think it's lag, guys. I, I mean, think I'm we're just stuck. Things, but I'm killing things. Does everybody see the town portal I just made? I'm definitely experiencing legit lag. Yeah, I don't think it's lag, guys. So I just made that town portal and uh, I'm fine. I think we were just literally stuck. Okay. Yeah. I'm definitely, I'm definitely, definitely lying. Well, it's kinda, I, I find kind of like really game breaking that you can't like move past someone. Yeah, like especially that. in in close quarters combat situations like this. Yeah, it just seems, it doesn't seem right at all. I'm not lagging quite so much. So I guess if we were uh, kind of reviewing this, Got our replay. I guess we would say that's one of the drawbacks. I'd probably give this game like a three out, of, three out of ten. A three out of ten for that reason. Because of that. Yep. Yeah, that's a pretty. That's pretty fair. <laughs> I think so. No, that's, Everything uh, else about it's great. But yeah, no, reason, but that's it's it's horrible. Drops. That, that's horrible. I mean, they should they should like yeah. clip right through there. That's at least, you know, a seven point dock. On the old Richter scale. In fact, you oh, might even be being generous, to be honest. Oh yeah? What would you give it? I'm feeling about a one right now. Ouch. What was, uh... What was, what was Shrek's fairy tale freak down? 0 0.5. 0 0.5? Oh. Well... Hey, someone want to set up a t uh, town portal? Are we dying? There's yeah, a town portal here, but it leads to uh, the oasis. Oh wait, no, there's there's a portal inside the portal. That's confusing. What? It was like <laughs> there was two portals like on top of one another. That's what were they doing? Yeah, it's some a freaky portal on portal action there. It's, it's like Inception. <laughs> it's, it's like Inception. <laughs> yeah, except with portals, make it even That's more confusing. That's how I answer everything now. It's like Inception. <laughs> Is it weird that I've never seen that movie? Like Inception. <laughs> That's very weird. I love that movie. I heard it was overrated. No, I, I would really not like say it. that at all. 
there are people who think it's overrated. I can understand I, I where it comes from because like, so many people thought it was overrated. <laughs> so many good qualities about it. It's completely original, cinematography is good, just a lot of good. The it's only problem, the really major well problem I movie. have with it, the major problem I have with it is that so much of the dialogue is expository, so it feels like they're constantly telling you exactly what's going on, but you're watching the movie, you know what's going so on. So it's kind of like they're playing you like you're stupid. That's exactly yeah. what they're doing, though. They're basically... I mean, and plus there, I mean, there are a lot of rules, so I understand, like, the movie has its own, like, logical subset of rules that it plays around with, and it has to explain those. Right. Yeah. But sometimes it gets a little absurd. Yeah, like, I mean, I know people that, like, didn't, like, understand, like, anything in the movie, so, I mean, maybe you're just a smart I kid, I don't know. I don't understand. They explain things yeah. in such detail. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. Like that's how, that's one of my biggest criticisms, I'd say, with the uh, Harry Potter as a whole, is how expository it is. It's, it's like... I don't know, it, I feel like I'm being told the same thing over and over again like 500 times every time I read or watch one of those books or movies. Yeah. Not I'm a big Harry just... Potter fan, by the way. No, I only saw the, the recent one that came out, the part one of uh, that. That was probably not... When, I mean, I'm not a big fan of the movies, but if I were to say one was my least favorite, that'd be one of the ones I would say was my least favorite. Yeah. It took a while. Like, and it was a little slow and didn't really make a lot of sense either. And I'd seen all the movies before it, and I still didn't know what the hell they were doing. <laughs> no, yeah, I imagine me, I, I hadn't seen any of them. My favorites had to be three. Three, they really advanced, at least condensed it all for uh, people like who are still new to the series, and at least give them some leeway. Uh, but the way how they advance, like they didn't go too fast. That's what I liked about it. Hmm. And uh, pretty much we already went through like all seven books. You have no idea how uh, how crazy some people would wait outside, like watching them just for the midnight watch. Yeah, I couldn't do all that. I mean, as as big of a fan as I am of like Lord of the Rings, which I kind of may have mentioned earlier, uh, I would never, you know, camp out just to see a Lord of the Rings movie. I mean, I couldn't put myself through that. Would you watch a Lord of the Rings movie while camping? <laughs> would you do it for a Scooby snack? <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking like this is like a green eggs and ham. Oh, shit. You know, yeah. would you do it in a? Uh, the, guys, please move. Would you do it on a plane? Would you do it in the rain? <laughs> <laughs> you know. Do it on a boat? Would you do it with a goat? <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, dear. We went I would there. not do it, Sam. I am. I would not eat green eggs and ham. <laughs> uh, where the hell are we going? And that is Dr. <laughs> Seuss, everybody. <laughs> that is the good teacher called the, the Dr. Seuss. The wise doctor. He called you Dr. Seuss? Wow. Yeah, she called me Dr. Seuss because you know, like, everybody put a lot of emphasis on the sus. They just like took oh, a Alphonse Zeus. <laughs> like, where? No. I think we're lost. I sure we gotta go. Yeah, we. Yeah. There's only one, I guess, possible further route. What other route do you see? Oh, oh, Christ alive. I'm stuck behind. Oh, gosh. There's more beetles over here. Beetle? I hate the beetles. <laughs> They're such an overrated <laughs> band. Oh, boy. <laughs> I disagree. <laughs> oh boy. I love the Beatles. We're gonna have that conversation. I found <laughs> I found the maggot layer level two, everybody. I don't yeah. like the maggot. So we oh wait, I gotta meet you guys. I gotta meet you guys. Hold up a little bit. We can just uh, go down I'll here wait. instead of talking about how the Rolling Stones are such a better band than the Beatles. Mm. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, you just, just can't let it go. <laughs> oh, apparently I can. Do you guys wanna go back to town? Because I wanna go back to town real quick. Town, okay? My inventory is as empty as it could possibly be, but I'll just wait right here. My inventory is incredibly packed. My inventory is always yeah, in full. This is how I do. I wish your uh, inventory was more about weight than uh than yeah, item that's size. size of it. Yeah, I think that's an improvement that a lot of more current games have made uh, to the inventory system. You know, uh, not even just current games. A lot of older games had systems like that, and they were perfectly functional. You know. Well, and then you take games such as, um, you know, the games where it just there's a set number of items you can have. It's not by weight. It's not by item size. It's just you can have like 50 items. Yeah, and that's like, that's like absurd. You get a 50 ring mails, or you can have 50 gems. You know, 
Yeah, or, or you take like uh, Pokemon, for example, is uh, one that I can think of, right? or or uh, a lot of the Final Fantasy series also. Final Fantasy, mm -hmm. even still, it just goes by number of items, not by weight yep. or size. Yeah. So you can have like you know just massive armor sets and pieces of swords and stuff, but. You know, and then you've also got like like first person shooters that let you carry two weapons. Those two weapons could be like a rocket launcher and a sniper rifle. You know, yeah. Like that's I've always felt was unreal. I think I think like like first person shooters should do it on like a holster basis. Like you have a pistol holster, and then you have like a rifle sling, and you have pockets for bullets and grenades and crap like that. They there do it, like, is a game like, that does that. Pieces. Yeah, there's what game is it? I would love to experience this. I'm trying to remember. Yeah, because I mean, I know that there's a game sort of like that that I think I've played, but they definitely need to, like, that should be the next big innovation in first-person shooters, is having, like, context inventory. There's definitely a game that does what you just described, though. Yeah, I mean, a lot of people don't like that, though. That could be a turnoff to a lot of people. That I mean, is true. A lot true. of people don't like doing inventory work and everything. One thing I love you about, know, for example, the Unreal Tournament series we were mentioning earlier before we started the recording was that, you know, you, any weapon you find during the game is added to your weapon loadout. And, uh, oh, I didn't know everybody went through the whole, um, every weapon know. in the game you can get, so you can have, you know, all eight weapons at your disposal, and as soon as you run out of ammo in yeah. one, you just quickly switch to the next one. And, uh, I mean, of course it suited the fast-paced nature of the Unreal Tournament games, and I understand that yeah. other shooters are a little slowed down, you know, like... Uh, yeah, I mean, it depends, on all of what, it depends on what you're really in the mood for, you know, like, sometimes I really do like playing Unreal Tournament game, but sometimes I do want to play something that's a little bit more realistic. Yeah. So... Yeah. Agreed. Like a, like a real tournament game. <laughs> real tournament? <laughs> to the, to the death. tournament. That'd be, like, the most... Like, nobody would buy that, like, real tournament. Be to like the a, death. Be like a chess, chess tournament. Chess tournament 2013. <laughs> <laughs> Is there one thing I like about these crowded things? The boulder can just go right through and hit everything. Yeah, the <laughs> having magic really helps here. Especially uh, if you're a sorceress and you had the chain lightning ability. Uh, oh, chain lightning so good. You wreck shop oh. right here on this part of the game. Yeah, like, this is the part of the game where the sorcerers really become like, a valuable asset. Like, in the first act, she's kind of, like, whatever, and she's kind of weak and stuff like that. But in here, she just gets ridiculous power. Of course, later in the game, she becomes completely weak, simply because yeah. everything is the Amazon takes over. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> so says oh Tim, God. the Amazon. <laughs> You know, everything starts to become immune to magic, like in the higher difficulty. Yeah, levels. that sucks. You really have to have really sorceress is just kind of left on her. Own. Yeah, unless you unless she's got like a good balance and she can get that one weakness, but that's still tough. So if they have like immune to magic and stuff, are they let's say are they more vulnerable to like physical attack or? Nope. Oh wow. Yeah, no. I'm telling you, when you get into hell mode, it gets hard. Um, I think this maggot just laid its eggs. That is, yeah, maggots will lay eggs. Oops. That is a maggoty thing for them to do. Uh, oh no, no, no! Oh no! Oh, god. oh my god, it's so scary. Ooh, wow, that was close. I can't, like, run away because there's someone behind me and I wasn't. <laughs> yeah, this is kind of <laughs> tricky here because uh, you don't have much chance to uh, escape. Uh, I think I'm gonna put a town portal in my. Oh, nope, that didn't want to do that. Oh well. I feel like, uh. There's nothing down here. It's taking a long time to get anywhere. That too. Split up, gang. Split up, gang. <laughs> I think we'd all die if we did that. <laughs> we didn't have much luck with that earlier. It's like a horror movie. <laughs> Yeah, it's it's so stupid. Oh, there's a serial killer inside the house. Oh, okay, I'll go take a look. Why? <laughs> Alone. Why? It's all the cops. Yeah, this being like take a damn look. I was like, oh, there were serial killers inside. Oh, I want to see. Uh, hey, you got that? <laughs> oh, hey guys. Oh. The advantage to these narrow passageways, though, is that their lightning is not nearly as effective because so yeah. much of it is just hitting the walls. Yeah, that's what I was thinking earlier. I was like, at least I can kind of face these guys head on. And yeah. Oh, hey, look, survive. it's Maggot Lair level 3. Ready? I'm going back to town real quick. Okay. 
I feel like I just need to regroup and like get my head together before every floor. <laughs> I bought so many healing potions. I don't even buy healing potions, I just pick them up off the ground. It it sounds so really many. sanitary, I know. <laughs> 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 just pick a potion off the ground. No big thing. It's still clean. You know, I've been five sharing second rule. potions again. <laughs> you can get AIDS. Five that second rule, you know. Mm. Practice safe potioning. <laughs> I forgot to. Uh... There's like an entire row of low quality wolf heads over here. Yeah. Uh, I, I find that I find it I find it somewhat humorous. Why? I don't know, like, why are there just all these low quality wolf heads? Somebody could have just sold them or. something. Someone's taking all the good wolf heads and leaving well, the shitty ones on the ground. Actually, there's a wolf head of self repair over here. We have a damaged. <laughs> we have a damaged, damaged wolf, wolf head, head a low quality wolf head, and a wolf head of self repair. How does the head go down the back of level 3? I'm gonna wait for Raz to get back before we uh, clear through Maggot Lair level 3. I am now in Maggot Lair level 2. Oh. Y'all keep going to the next level and you're like, oh. Yeah. There's like well. <laughs> He's on point. Yeah. <laughs> right, you wanna take point or should I? Let's split up, gang. Can't really... Open the friggin' door. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm having that problem too. Whoop. Got the knee. Oh, there. Go this way? Sure. This way, Just go, go. this way. Spam that. Oh, I I made it dumb. I blocked myself off. Oh man, this, this is great. I'm sorry. I I, oh. I made <laughs> I made a uh, bone wall right in front here and <laughs> I can't well, get, I can't get through it. The last. <laughs> There we go, it, it, it finally destroyed itself. Wow, somehow my, my double got behind all the enemies and started throwing up. Yeah, they can teleport. Yeah, weird. I love that. I love the teleporting hireling. My favorite trick. Yeah. Holy freaking crap. He's on fire. So many fireballs. Hey, hey, you might want to move up a little bit. Hey, All right. don't tell me what to do. Hey, hey. I want this door open. Nice. Close door. Right, yeah, we got to open it. Should be nicer to ladies. There we go. Oh, hell. Hey, I'm a little. Pressure. There's nothing down that way. It's just a dead end. Wow. A mace, a yellow mace. It's yeah. just empty desolation. Yeah, they they weren't really thinking about the multiplayer when they designed the maggot layer. No. Yeah. Or maybe oh. they were. They just wanted to piss us <laughs> Yeah, they were just yeah. fucking with us. This will make them slow down a little bit. This is screw up those people trying to do super reboot. Someone's someone's mercenaries like twitching out on the wall. I don't even know what they're doing. I think doing. that's mine. Is it's li he's literally there? she's literally just spazzing at the wall. Yeah, actually, he's trying to get to me, but. Well, we got boss here. There's a there's she's a break she was shit. 41 for paladin. There's a boss over there. Over here. Oh wait, no, I found the gold. Okay, guys, the, uh, everybody needs to be over here where I'm at. Okay, oh, wait, uh, I'm gonna kill them. Yes. This is where the final boss is done. Alright, I'll be right there. She's a oh, damn okay. Obama. What's up? Okay. If I can even find her, get to her. If I can even get to you. Is it over by the gold box? Uh, yeah. Oh, Christ. She's a big, she's a big old lady. Uh, cold worm the burrower. Holy Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I'll I'll be right there. Oh, I can't get in. I can't get in. <laughs> Oh, uh, there is We're poison stuck. in this room. Oh, oh my god. Hey, do you want to 
I'm t it's just so hard to We're stuck behind block. We're stuck behind him, I think. <laughs> I can't move either. I can't move. I'm stuck behind him. Can okay, move one. Can everybody see oh, this? God. this glorious <laughs> maggot? Oh, Whoa. kill it with fire. It's disgusting. It's like a beast. <laughs> Oh yes, please. Um, I'm gonna grab that Cestus, cause that's for me. Oh, Staff of Kings, how nice. Ooh. Oh, Staff of Kings. Oh, Staff of Kings. Oh, Staff of Kings. <laughs> oh, very nice, very nice. Staff of Kings. Oh, very good. Is anybody a paladin? Uh, no, I think the paladin is, uh, Jesus Christ, I'm poisoned. <laughs> I think Jesus Christ, paladin? I think Austin is the paladin. Oh, is there I want to say Austin is the paladin. There's an awesome shield back there for paladin. Yeah, because Connor was the sorceress, so it, it would be yeah, Connor's Connor's out. Uh, I think he's still going to be sorceress. Oh, he is? I think so. Good, good. that's good. I'm, I'm happy to hear that. I'm going to go back to town again. Yeah, does anybody have the time? Yeah, I have no uh, idea. Like we've been, we've been on Easter. Skype for only an hour. The time, so. time, or how, how long we've been recording? Uh, time. recording. Oh. I don't know. What time did we start? I want to say it was nine thirty. It's eleven. What? Oh, <laughs> time is <really> different. <laughs> <laughs> Ten o'clock for me. How long have it's we been expert. doing this? You mean we've been on Skype for an hour, so it's probably a little an less hour. An hour. Maybe no, like fifty was... minutes or so. A little more than that. Okay. I don't know. I just don't know how much further we can get because, Jack. like, like we were saying, this uh, this town the takes a long time to get through. Yeah. The so staff of kings time. is like the second one, right? Yep. Funny story about the staff of kings is, uh, even though it is a quest item that we'll need for something later, you can actually equip it right now if you want, and it's somewhat useful if you're into magic. It does Try tend to sell. Oh, I can't sell it? No, hell no, it's a quest item. Uh. Yeah. I almost don't want to sell this because it's such a cool name. What is it? The Death Splitter. <laughs> that is a pretty cool name. It even cuts death in half. Oh, is that, what it, that works. is that what it does? I believe so. Holy moly. Oh, you know what? I think my hireling is dead. Your what? My hireling. I, you wonder. I, I think your hireling is stuck on a wall back no, in it, that maggot maze. It died and uh, Ben Tech.